by them, uh, but we do understand and we do believe that they are a feature uh, of the care environment and uh, there is a concern and I think clearly our concern is shared by our colleagues in the HSE Crisis Pregnancy Agency. I'd like to move on to your excellent question in relation to referral um, and I suppose really what we have is, is the classical Irish solution to the Irish problem. When my parents were in practice it was all about the oral contraceptive pill which we provided and we were allowed to prescribe for cycle regulation. So if you had the slightest hygen, smidgen of a cycle, a regular cycle you were all right. Uh, later on we were allowed to uh, I think make condoms available providing you were married. Uh, now we're able to talk about uh, termination but we're not allowed to actually make a referral. Um, and from a medical perspective, uh, on one hand, we do say that uh, abortion is a relatively safe medical procedure and there's objective evidence that that is the case. On the other hand, the experience that we're subjecting women, particularly who travel for abortion, uh, from a psychological perspective, uh, the Basically, it's traumatic to consider uh, any sister or mother uh, or, or daughter travelling to UK abortion clinic under these circumstances, uh, sick with the uh, symptoms of early pregnancy, uh, the uncertainty of what they're embarking on, the cost, etc., and so on. Um, in that context, uh, it, many of us believe uh, that it makes far more sense uh, that if, if a referral is to be made, that the referral can be done in the medical fashion uh, or that other solutions are examined. That is the situation in, in relation to making a referral. And then in two 